guys, welcome to my channel. Um, today I am coming to you from the car because I am maximizing my time. Um, you might notice my neck looks a little bit red. You can probably see it. I uh, have something that's called brown tail moth. I was out in the driveway um, doing COVID activities, uh, chopping up wood that's been in the turnaround for too long. And while I was doing that, I unknowingly was exposed to some brown tail moth caterpillars um, and for those of you who don't know brown tail moth caterpillars in the northeast are quite a nuisance they have spines that contain toxins which can then cause your skin to react and have a histamine response uh, which is what's going on with my neck so um, did not know I was exposed to them after the until after the fact, my neck started feeling a little itchy um, the morning after I cut wood, um, and then started really getting itchy, but didn't um, didn't really present with a rash yet. Uh, although it felt like it should look worse than it felt, um, and then finally the uh, rash broke out, and here we are. Uh, and it is so itchy. Um, I'm actually going to look into seeing what I can do for a natural remedy. I've done alcohol and actually believe it or not duct tape um, they say that applying duct tape um, can actually pull some of the little spines out um, so yeah you better believe that at one point I had duct tape on my neck um, that is definitely not why it's so red it's red independent of the fact that I use duct tape um, whether it helped or not I can honestly say it's still pretty itchy So I'm going to look, the, I was given the name of a compounding pharmacy that apparently has some miracle uh, salve type compound that they make and I'm going to see if I can get my hands on some of that because uh, this is miserable. 